Good morning. I'm Dr. Subha, plastic and reconstructive surgeon. Plasticos means to mold. It is a Greek word. Plastic surgery term was coined much before the invention of the engineering material plastic and doesn't hold any relation to it. The history of plastic surgery goes uh, way back to 800 BC in India where Dr. Sushrita, an sur Indian surgeon, was known to reconstruct injured parts like cut noses. He is considered as the father of plastic surgery all over the world. Plastic surgery involves reconstruction or restoration or alteration of body. Plastic surgery mainly consists of reconstructive surgery and aesthetic surgery which is commonly known as the cosmetic surgery. Aesthetic surgery everyone like almost everyone is aware of aesthetic surgery as it is mostly sought of by celebrities and uh, receives uh, much applause and attention from everyone. But the lesser known part and the major part of plastic surgery is reconstructive surgery. Reconstructive surgery is bringing back to normal the injured parts or any parts damaged due to injury like road traffic accidents, parts damaged in cancer surgeries which are uh, uh, like congenital defects. Some people are born with some congenital defects, we reconstruct those parts and reconstructive surgery includes hand surgeries, micro surgery, trauma, cancer surgery and congenital defects. Reconstruction involves almost every organ or every tissue in the body. Skin damaged in an accident or due to burns can be reconstructed by just a skin or tissue from elsewhere in the body. Reconstruction of injured or broken bones especially of the face is done by plastic surgeons. Maxillofacial surgery is a part and parcel of plastic surgery. Reconstruction of muscles which are injured in trauma and accidents or removed due to cancer is done by plastic surgeons. Reconstruction of nerves damaged or injured due to accident or burns or brachial plexus injury is also done by plastic surgery. Reconstruction of blood vessels like in totally amputated parts like hand, leg or fingers toes, genitalia, nose, ears and even the scalp can be reconstructed by a plastic and reconstructive surgeon.